I have no idea what this background is, but I can't get it off. Good morning, everyone. It is um, Sunday morning, leftover cake chat. I am waiting on Aaron here. And it's super bright out here, but it's so nice out today. I'm actually sitting outside. So we're going to give Aaron a minute. Today we're actually talking about virtual planning. Oh, there's Aaron. Let's see if I can get her added on here. Okay, hopefully you can hear me. You are in the process, and if that is the case, oh my God, you're there. Let's hope I morning. Can. Yay, and I can even hear you. Amazing. Perfect. It's a little bright. I was just saying, and I have ice cream cake this morning, and it's melting. Uh, <laughs> you're outside. That's outside. perfect. It's super warm out today. It's a beautiful day. I'm actually on Marco Island today, so. Um, talking about virtual planning, uh, we can do this from anywhere, right? Absolutely. That's the best part of it. I, I'm not quite sure what this um, little background screen thing is. Can you see it? It says something about, I pledge for something, and I can't read it, but I can't also get it off the screen. So, you know, we're at least live. Well, and hopefully it's a good cause. So we support good causes. Yeah. <laughs> So cheers, we're here. Um, I, you know, I my little minis this morning. I love these these little guys. Anything little is fabulous with me. So I'm gonna toast to us being on together. The champagne was gone, so I went with some Chardonnay. So it all works. Chardonnay at 10 a.m. Actually, it's 9 a.m. for you. It's 9 a.m. You know, sometimes the days just happen. So here we are. <laughs> Okay, well, I need to take a bite of this cake before it melts. And um, Oh, and I have to tell you what I have because, yeah, what do you, there's, I don't know what happened. There's a dolphin, <laughs> and I can't show because oh. I'm sure I would screw everything up, but literally a dolphin right out here in the canal. It's so cool. Um, I think I hear it. So um, you, I have Bailey's ice cream cakes. Oh, my God, right? Bailey's is like yeah. my favorite thing, except for, as you can see, it is melting. So this is going to have fast and furious. It's cake and ice cream and chocolate. Oh, not pretty, but so you, it looks good. Oh my God. Yeah. So you have Bailey's and you're laughing at me for having Chardonnay. Not quite sure how that works, but okay. Um, I actually, this morning, you can't really see it very well. I have Ho-Ho's. Oh my God. So they had a dessert station and you know that I absolutely love the fact that people tie in like things that have happened in the past or things that they used to share, whatever. So this couple, um, they, when they met, they both were servers and they didn't have a lot of money and blah, blah, blah. So they used to go to the store and just buy like ho-hos and beer and they would go sit on the beach and just kind of talk and get to know each other and spend some time. So I love the fact that they tied in the ho-hos to the their dessert station of course, it's chocolate cake, essentially, which I'm super happy about. So cheers to them, and I'm going to enjoy. That is so cool. I love it. I love it. There's some strange things that people do. Oh, um, I know that we have some superstitions around, like, hurricanes and, and storms, and we've been dealing with that. And for me, like, I have Lucky Charms and SpaghettiOs and Franks, like, because you can eat those, and they're not going to go bad, but they are so bad. <laughs> That's funny. Whole another story. So virtual planning today. Um, you're in Nashville. I'm on Marco Island. So we can do this anywhere. We can do this for our clients as well. Um, the nice thing about virtual planning is now we have Zoom, Be Live, Facebook Live, uh, all of these conduits, if you will, to be able to actually talk to our person face to face, where it used to just be a phone call and email. So it's actually really easy to help people plan now. Uh, you know, we primarily focus on destination weddings, so we're very accustomed to that. Um, but even if you're in the next town over, we know how busy people's lives can be, and we respect time. So I'm going to let you and, chat for a minute about that. Yeah, I mean, back in the old days, in the old days, right? Um, I say that like I'm we are super old. <laughs> yeah, we are veterans, I guess. <laughs> um, good morning, Barb and Lori. Thanks for joining us. Lori, you're not doing a delivery right now. That's exciting. You're watching us. Uh, Lori is the creator and owner of Cupcake Sushi, which we talk about fondly all the time. So um, yeah. welcome. Thanks for joining. 
Which doesn't um, my Bailey's ice cream cake. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so virtual planning, you always talk to somebody on the phone, right? And you're, you always say to them, I can't wait to put a face with a name, you know, because you're always corresponding on the phone. You have no idea who this person is. So virtual planning, <laughs> she's in the car, <laughs> the car wash, Lori. Okay. So virtual, yeah, virtual planning is amazing because you can see who you're talking to. You can see that we're a real person. You can have a conversation with us. You can see our facial reactions to questions, which mine are probably not the best. Um, zero, but you know, face. zero poker face. Yeah, I don't have a poker face. You can you can totally tell what I'm thinking by my face. But you know, as as a client our clients appreciate that because when they say something that's totally off the wall, I'm looking at them like, that sounds amazing, but let me tell you what's going to happen next after that happens. So they, they're like, okay, now I realize what's going on. Now I can go in the right direction. So for me, the virtual planning and how we actually do it is I love because not only can you talk to us anywhere, if you're Lori in the car wash, um, <laughs> but you can also see us. You can have a conversation with a real person. It's not just a voice on the phone and you can, you know, it's, it's more personal and wedding planning is about personalization. It's about things being incredibly personal to what you want for your day. So being able to see who you're talking to, I think is amazing. Good morning, Gail. <laughs> Lori's laughing. Yeah. I, I mean, seriously, we have one of my favorite pictures is um, the bride on the treadmill. You know, she's got her ear. Oh, yeah. She's getting in her workout and on the phone, you know, doing wedding planning because most people, let's think about it, get up at, you know, the crack of dawn, try to get in some workout, get in breakfast, usually have a commute to work, whether it's a train car, walking, whatever. Um, and you can talk to us, you know, during that commute, you can talk to us during your exercise program. You most likely still want to have a life while you're actually um, planning your wedding. You do want to remain fiance of the year and uh, in good graces with your family and your fiance. So don't get stressed out. You know, I mean, Lori's asking, um, she has a bride who isn't committed to Key West. Well, Lori, as you know, we do planning anywhere uh, and weddings anywhere. So if she needs some help, we are happy to uh, help her. Um, we are also send her just do the virtual planning for her. She does not want an on-site planner because Aaron, you, as you talked earlier with me about this, not everyone wants a planner. Um, so the virtual planning can be for specifically what your need is at the time. Yeah. And Lori, we obviously, uh, I lived in Key West for 10 years and Kristen is, we won't say how many years Kristen's been back and forth between Key West, um, <laughs> but, you know, send her our way. We can definitely direct her. We can give her, you know, suggestions on vendors. We can give her suggestions on location, on pricing, on dates. You know, Key West is very expensive, but we know the tricks of the trade, so to speak, on when is a great time to visit, um, not only price-wise, but weather-wise as well. So, we are happy to assist with that for sure. Um, can I can I just pipe in and say one thing about virtual planning? <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll sit here quietly and drink my Chardonnay then. <laughs> um, no, <laughs> but I, you know, I'm very much a independent woman for anybody that knows me. Um, yeah. See okay. the roll of the eyes. This I'll is great. I'll yeah. <laughs> um, I. Love you are welcome, Lori. I love doing things myself, but I am the first person that will raise their hand and be like, I don't know. Uh, I need help. I need suggestions. I am huge on recommendations, um, you know, because I know what I know and I don't know what I don't know. So I want to do things right. I want to be successful and I ask for help when I need it. And I feel like there's a lot of people out there that want that they you know the do-it-yourself bride the DIY bride is out there for a reason because they do have the extra time they do have the ability to do it but let's face it have you planned a wedding before probably not have I designed a house before no I have no idea how to do that I call somebody 
Do I know, you know, Chris, we're very good at different things. Kristen's is the one that can put five colors together and make it look great. <laughs> I'm going to go with one and it's going to be white because it's just going to work, you know, <laughs> but I'm going to tell you exactly how much to the penny each one is going to cost. And then we're going to go from there. So I know what I'm good at and, you know, I'm going to ask for professional advice when I need it. And I think that's what really what the virtual planning is for. It's for the bride that wants to plan their wedding by themselves. They have the ability to do it, but let's face it. There's going to be a time when you need help. You're going to need a checklist. You're going to need somebody to put a budget together. You don't know how much everything's going to cost. Um, you're going to need that person to say, this is the floral arrangement that I want. And you're going to need Kristen to say, that's great if you're going to have your wedding in April, but <laughs> those are not August flowers. Um, so just having that person that you can call on for 15 minutes, I think is absolutely amazing because you're not going to have to spend the thousands of dollars that, you know, full service planning costs because Full service planning is a lot of time. We are working at 1130 at night and 230 in the morning uh, planning your wedding when it's full service planning. And don't get me wrong, we're up at those times. So if you want a virtual call at those times, we will certainly do it. <laughs> Kristen and I email and text back and forth at 330 in the morning all the time. Well, especially but, if you're in a different time zone, right? So we have California yeah. clients. We have, you know, we've had clients in Europe that are coming to the States. Um, we've had clients here that are getting married in Ireland. Uh, you know, so we have to adjust ourselves um, to those schedules. And if you're working a full-time job, which, you know, let's face it, 95% of our clients work, um, yep. you still have a life, you know, you've got to go grocery shopping, you've got to, you know, exercise, you've got to eat right, and you've got to do your job. So again, if you want to do parts of it yourself, that's great. Uh, Pinterest is, has, you know, changed the world on that because you basically mm -hmm. sit there and, again, I don't know how much time during the day you have to pin things, but um, a lot of people pin at 2.30 in the morning. <laughs> and then we, we get those notifications. <laughs> cut off on us because Anna was like pinning at like 2 to 4 a.m. every day and I was getting the notifications. I was like, oh my goodness. <laughs> Um, anyway, so just, you know, again, virtual planning, we're happy to help you with as little as you'd like, or as much as you'd like. Um, it is the way of the world, you know, people are now kind of, they live with their phones, which can be a good thing and a bad thing. But in this aspect, um, you know, we hope that being virtual again, no matter where you are, no matter where we are, no matter what we're doing, we can stop and kind of pop away and and either answer your questions or uh, set up a time that we can chat for longer if something uh, more in depth is needed. Yeah, absolutely. Good morning, Jennifer. Thanks for joining in. Um, we have different packages on our website, www.swivelgroupevents.com, and you can pick individual services or we've packaged some together that a lot of people have gotten and discounted those packages um, from if you were going to just get all the individual services. So uh, definitely take a look at that. Do sign up for a free virtual chat. We can go through um, everything that you're looking to do. And then from there, just suggest the specific services that you would need. Again, if you just wanna schedule a 15 minute call to say, I have no idea, I'm between these dates for these reasons and I'm getting pushed this way from this person and this this way from this person, um, we can definitely help sort you through all of that, those details to do that. If you just want a checklist that we use, um, you know, it's definitely very detailed. You're going to get it and be like, holy cow, this is everything that they do for a wedding, but it's definitely in order. It's, it's very detailed. So that way all you have to do is check through it. Hence the checklist name. Um, we have a budget spreadsheet that you can download and utilize that automatically calculates. So that way, if something changes, it'll change the bottom line and that way it can help you. Negotiate contracts for you, review contracts for you and give you suggestions, all sorts of different services for um, you that will just benefit you in the end. And again, it's all budget oriented. So anything else? Did we miss anything on virtual planning? I love it. It's, it's one of my favorite services that we provide. Yeah, no, it's super easy, super fun. It connects us with people all over. 
and um, it's starting to rain right now, which is crazy because the sun is shining. So uh, I'm going to have to move in fast because I've got both my laptop and my phone out here. Um, so happy Sunday, everyone. Sorry for the abrupt um, ending, but if I ruin my laptop, Aaron's going to kill me. <laughs> I will. <laughs> All right. Thanks for joining us, guys. It's Cheers. the last Saturday. Cheers. Sunday, Aaron. It's Sunday. Oh my gosh, it's Sunday. It's the last Sunday of September. Bye. We'll get there. I'll be I'll be gone the next two Sundays. Have fun. Bye.